Hi guys, welcome to this short video about the options which we have for noise cancellation in USB microphones. Here I have two of them. Here on the left side we have the MRSD. Why? It's a really nice one, has a lot of options, even color, has gain, has noise cancellation built in, but of course it's a little bit on the lower price end, also of course has an impact on the quality, and here on the right side we have a microphone which is in about in the same price range but doesn't have noise reductions. So basically we have two options when we really need noise reduction. For example when we have a loud AC running in the background which I have all the time or almost all the time also at this moment here. I don't know if you can hear that. I'm recording with a premium smartphone so I don't know if you can hear that but when I'm using these microphones without noise reduction then we can hear the noise from the AC. So we have two options here. We can use the noise reduction from underneath. That's the thing here. We can turn it on. Then we get this light. Then it's using noise reduction. But I had the impression that it's not exactly same quality anymore or not same quality as here. I think in general we don't have the same quality here uh, as here. And here we don't have any kind of noise reduction, there are no buttons here, not even a mute. The only thing which we have is this gain control, but I have it on maximum anyway because it's not a super sensitive microphone. I mean both have a decent sensitivity, but they don't have high sensitivity. And because this microphone is a little bit better, I wanted to test what options we have. And we definitely have still some options here also with the five fine so we can record something and after that remove the noise with some programs. A good option I think at the moment is the Adobe. I have it here. I have the website podcast.adobe.com and hence that's a free website. You can upload your audio and then convert it. It has some AI noise removal detection so we can upload and then download it again and use in a video editor or wherever you like. These are the two options which I want to compare. Of course it would be easier to use just a button here than recording, upload, download. But at the very end they are pretty much at the same price point. So this is what I'm doing now. So I'm going to record two samples while the AC is running. Uh, the one here with the noise reduction, the one here without noise reduction, upload it to Adobe, download it again and then show you the result and then you can compare and I will also listen to that and let you know what I think but it would be also super interesting to learn from you what you think. So first let's start with the video sample here. Okay, so that's the sample from the MRSD why and this is without the noise cancellation so I'm pushing the button here and now the noise cancellation button is turned on I hope you can still understand me and the noise from the AC should be more or less gone I hope and now I have switched to the Fifine microphone and this is first without any kind of noise cancellation so you should hear the AC running in the background and this is the second recording also from the Fine Fine but uploaded to Adobe.com to the AI noise removal I've removed the noise or it has removed the noise or at least it should have removed the noise and after that I've downloaded it and this is what you can hear now. So you heard both or actually four of the samples and my preference is actually yeah, leaning more and more towards the MRSDY not only because of the super cheap price but also because it's very convenient to have this noise reduction just on the convenience of a button press and after listening a couple of times to the voice with and without the noise cancellation of this microphone 
I still have some problems to figure out which one is which one. So I think there's not a big difference. So you can really turn it on when it's needed or you can always turn it on. It's not such a huge disadvantage. Of course, it's not comparable to a Blue Yeti or it's not comparable to HyperX or whatsoever one of these premium microphones. But the problem with these microphones is that they don't come with any kind of noise cancellation at all so you would have to use the adobe solution and for me the adobe solution is still not a real good solution it sounds quite muffled really not natural i mean of course the mrsdy is also not perfect but i think it's still closer to my natural voice than using a premium microphone and the adobe noise cancellation so yeah i mean this is really my recommendation at the moment and so if you also have to work in a very noisy environment maybe ac or other things running in the background then this could be the thing for you I think for the moment I'm going with this one here, pretty happy with it, so I can fully recommend. And so if you're interested, I'll put down the link to the Amazon listing down into the description so you can check it out and order it right from there if you like it. And I hope I've been able to help you a little bit with this video. If you have any questions or comments, just write to the comment section below. And I'm always happy to talk about these things. And if you like the video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. See you next time.